first ranked game of set 11. Who's going to carry me? Maybe Miss Piggy. Miss Piggy will take me to victory, chat. I can taste it. it tastes like bacon. First in my is Prismatic Tier, Loot, Harley Varied Pool, 6-1. Okay, let's go for Loot Sub. Uh, I know everybody wants Prismatic. That's fine. I don't want to give high RNG variants early because I think early on, a lot of players are going to be bad. I don't want to give like auto win things. This will throw people off of their reroll comps because I think most people who are actually like prepped are going to play reroll. So this will throw them off. This is more flex. That's fine. Pot of gold is fine. That's literally just default nothing. Pot of gold is fun though. Yeah, sure. Kha'Zix reroll, I think, is eh. I think for Kha'Zix reroll to be good, you need a very specific augment. The one with the heavenly, so you can get the heavenly really fast. The one with the free rerolls. Otherwise, you just don't go for it. Ari and Rek'Sai. Rek'Sai really has no business at the moment. There's not much Rek'Sai can do. Ari reroll is okay. Best of luck. Thank you, friend. I actually think Ari 3 is solid. I've been looking at stats. Like, Ari, Yasuo, Double Darius. Okay, that's really easy. Um, My destination is clear. I want to buy the Malphite for Double Heavenly, but it's not necessary. I'm playing NA servers, that's why ping is so high. Exactly, correct. It's better than the PBE, so... We've got Heavenly here, times two. Kha'Zix, Malphite, Nico. Wow. Uh, Step back. Big strong Nico coming to Three Heavenly. Faded Dryad. Got a good faded opener as well. Maybe this was a mistake. Four components after you lose the health. Over encumbered after the next stage, you get two bench slots after three. For the next stage, you Oh wow, that's really weird. Yeah, you turn them two cards from me now, getting the same one every time you level up. I'm not a fan of that. Silver spoon. Stim pack. I think I'm gonna go for a completed item here. Wow, this is actually pretty nuts. Watch this. Uh, I don't need to slam anything here. I, oh wait, actually I might I might need to slam that for I've been kidding. Uh, that might have been a bad, bad person to give it to, but whatever. Uh, I need a win streak with this build. If we're not win streaking, we're, we're in a lot of trouble. This guy's board is really strong. Maybe I misplayed. I can I can I can sell the Nico. Like I'm probably not going for Heavenly. We'll see what happens. Oh, we have Story Weaver with Sage here. Come closer. Yeah, we, we play the Story Weaver every time. I'll get rid of Nico. And I can give the Okay, this is this is actually solid. I like this. We have Warden Story Weaver. That's a that's a solid start. I could go Ink Shadow as well, possibly. Like keep in mind, now we're playing for the win streaks, chat. Like we're going full win streak. Now that we're climbing on the on the on the main set, it's not about losing, it's not about like playing super greedy. No, no, we, we win fights. Oh my god, we have full wardens here.
zero loss run. Well, we're gonna try to keep, like, we're looking for top two, top three. So keeping our HP nice and high and wind streaking is one of the best ways to get there. So we're gonna be slamming items all the time. We're not gonna be playing greedy, like holding on for Biss items, looking for that perfect top one. No, we're playing for a top. I'm gonna sell Kha'Zix here in Malphite. I'm gonna make Econ. They weren't fitting anyway. Always Sivir in between two champs. Yes, correct. I'll do that. Thanks. Uh, four cost champions. Jesus Christ. I mean, that's kind of sick. Annie was, is kind of disgusting here. Galio Storyverse is kind of sick as well, though. I think I'm going to go for Galio. I could have gone for Annie. But Galio can push me to Story River 5 just for win streaking very, very hard. I do need to find Zoe for that, or Riven, but that's excellent. Now the problem with Galilo, Galileus, he's a bruiser. He's also exalted. Uh, Galio, Soraka, Bard. Hmm. I don't think Galio fits here as much as these do. Garen's warden. Yeah, he's probably better than Garen. Probably should have added him to the board. This is a win. He invented a telescope. Really? <laughs> Get out of here. Uh, only issue with Storyweaver is you probably want to play Zoe for the carry for a while. Well, I mean, you can, you can play vertical Storyweaver 7, I guess. Which is not bad either. That's why maybe I should have gone for Annie. I'm not sure. Let's pick up these two. Dragon Lord is always useful. No Riven yet. When I find Riven, I'm going to be ballering out of control. Thrush, Behemoth. Yeah, he's definitely better than the 3-board, and I agree with you. We need to make Econ now as well. He has Ash with no items. Okay. See how this goes. We're losing this fight, I think. No, we're not. Either. I think we win this fight. Yeah, we're good. I need a reposition. Wait, did I lose? <sighs> yes. Uh, I should have probably given this to to her. I was thinking of slamming it for. For Bloodthirster just to give a big spike. Uh, Yone is a really good unit. Like, Yone is one of the best reroll comps in the game, but what are people running here? Behemoth. So we're actually contested on Storyweaver. Ghostly. Dragonlord Mythic. What is this ghostly player doing? He has Morgana. Mythic. Ink Shadow. So no one's going for Yone reroll. That's, that's interesting. Possibly. Yone 2 and I have Biss items for him. I have very good Biss items. I have very good items for it. Uh, let's pick up Zyra here. I've got very good Yone items. Now this is not great, but it can fit on like a Morgana later on. I'm actually going to slam this, even though I want one of those gloves. Sivir in the middle, thanks. I'm gonna slam, and I'm gonna give this to Sivir for now. Yeah, this should be no problem. Umbral Yone. Yes, that's what I'm considering. There's a lot of ways to play Yone. There's a lot of ways to build him. But again, uh, because we're playing rank now, we're not playing PvE, we're, we're fully tryharding, which means we're trying to fully optimize our, uh, our climb. Carousel, free carousel, that's really good. I really like that. Um, Exiles, I'm not a huge fan. Every eight damage you deal to an enemy tactician gives you two gold. That's not bad. How good is lunch money? I don't know. Gain one Thieves Gloves. That's pretty good, too. 
healing orbs. Yeah, I'm gonna go for Thieves Gloves. I just win streak. I think win streak needs to play. I don't know. I'll give this to a Mumu maybe. This guy's really strong. Holy crap. Buen dia, Oz. Como esta? Tudo bem? Riven and Shop Thanks. You can go five now. It's, it's just yeah, just about getting these wins early, keeping this win streak alive, staying strong. Have you tried Umbral? Yes, it's one of the best comps in the game. Maybe the best comp in the game at the moment. Not even kidding. Like, I think it might be the best comp. I'm still not sure what we're going for. Wardens are extremely good frontline, but we do have an early Galio. What is this? Three rerolls that last until used. I could use them now. Ash, early Ash. Spirit, reveal our way. Ash gives Porcelain, which is kind of cool. I mean, she definitely goes over this guy, 100%. Right? Diana's interesting as well, if I want to go Dragon Lord. Well, I'm not necessarily going Dragon Lord. She's Sage, though. It makes my Amumu tanky. I don't know. It's very hard to say what the play here is. This guy went full story. Uh, I have better items than him, though, by far. Like, he has not even slamming items, so thankfully for us, we're just going to win due to itemization here. Okay. So we got the five, we got the eight win streak. We really got to go for the 10 win streak. I might level next round. It's not that expensive. And if I level next round, what is the... I can actually roll a little bit. Diana's also really good for... Her. All right. We're last to pick. So it doesn't really matter what we get. We got to figure out, are we AD or AP? This kind of wants us to be AP. AP is currently stronger than AD. But if you go full Story Weaver, it's, it's a mix. It could be an Ash game. It depends how fast they can get Ash too as well, right? Let's go with this. If I'm going for Galio, I mean, I can't give it to Galio then. I don't know. Let's go with armor. We'll figure out the damage items later. This is decent. Ah, adding this, how strong is it to add this? 32 gold. I don't lose that much. Just add her for now. This adds Sage, gives my backline some power, uh, and we're going to rebuild our economy now. We have a lot of pairs. I might as well roll a little bit. This world needs hope. No need now. Go to River 5. I could. I could. Sell Jax and Diana. I'm never selling Jax. Jax is warding. He goes well with it. I mean, I, I, can, I can figure it out. So I would need to add Garen and Riven. Yeah, it fits really well. Jax is a good unit. Jax is actually really... As long as I have a Mumu on the board, Jax is a very decent unit. Like, look how much he's tanking compared to everyone else. Solid warm -up. Who's next? Alawi, actually. Oh, man, I messed up. I threw. I missed the second Alawi. Uh... Roll a bit. Oh my god. Wait, what? Wait, what? That's a very early Lissandra. Galio's items are very interesting. He gets a nice little shield, which is cool. dead and now uh it comes down to jacks how strong is jacks you pivot now i think so too uh i can go warden porcelain i wish i had a porcelain emblem maybe it's arcanist although an arcanist bat would be best the problem with arcanist is i don't currently have uh any items for arcanist at all i do have yone too as well 
There is very little. Like, I can cut one Warden. I can cut Jax here. Like, I could do this. That might be the play. She will farm me stuff 100%. And who would I itemize if I cut this? I don't know who to itemize. It's probably not this guy. Man, I... This game is tough. I have... I have... I have three porcelain. I think it's not Yone. I have good Yone. I'm really not sure. I'm not playing Mythic. Need to pivot porcelain? I'm aware of that. All right, I'll, I'll pivot Porcelain next round. Hopefully I didn't throw here. I'll give Ash the Rage Blade, and uh, we'll go from there. Ash can work with Nashers. Uh, I'm not a huge fan of it. This guy is already also going Ash. We need to hit Ash 2 to stabilize with this build, by the way. Like, without Ash 2, we're kind of in trouble as well. Like, I think KL2 is doing a lot of work at the moment. Right? Like, KL2 is decent. Kale 2 does work. If we look at damage right now, like, Kale is pushing it. Kale 1 is a lot weaker. Kaboom is bad. Uh, Freaky Friday. Final Ascension. Freaky Friday is meh. Yeah, it's just Final Ascension. Accomplice. Is a uh, tiny but deadly. I think this is it. Maybe the attack speed is better. They're both really good. I I'm going to take this. Man... It's a weird play. I'm going to put Ash on the board here. I'm going to give Ash this and uh, pick up a Mumu. Get a free reroll here. Jesus. Wouldn't wish my fate on anybody. Okay, whatever. We'll see what happens. The attack speed is really nice because it starts my rage blade going really fast. And we need to hit Ash too if we want to play Porcelain. Then once we hit Ash 2, we can go Story River less. This guy's gonna win. Lilia 2 is insane here. This guy, this guy went nuts. I, I was never beating Lilia 2. How did he get Lilia 2 so early? What? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, how? He's level 7. I have to find Lux. Yeah, Lux would be good. That's really weird. Your spirit is Take it if you can. The last time I was never. Maybe one Sage is good. Maybe. Maybe. <sighs> Sorak is good here. I can add Sorak to the board. Lux on the show. Wait, did I miss Lux? Oops. Did I really miss a Lux in the shop? Oh no. <laughs> oh no. It's okay. Lux is good. Yeah, I'll get her eventually. These items are really weird, man. I don't know what I want. Probably gloves. I mean, now we just take a little expensive unit. Let's focus on this Lux, not to miss it. What do I cut for Lux? I, I can cut Story Weaver entirely. Alawi. I lose, uh, I lose, what do you call it? I lose a lot of value. 
by putting Alawi. But Alawi has no items at the moment. Um, we need to find Ash too. Without Ash too, we're in trouble. And Ash is contested, so that's also another problem for us. We also have, yeah, we're, we're, we're in a lot of trouble here. I have to, I'm not playing Set, I think. I'm pretty sure Set doesn't have, no, he actually, what am I saying? Set fits really well. I'm an idiot. I do have to cut Storyweaver entirely. I think Storyweaver just doesn't fit. I'm going to lose Shred. But I gain, I get a lot of Wardens on the board. Oh, how am I going to play this? Add Sniper at some point? Yeah, I know, I know. I know I need to add Sniper at some point. Okay, give me a sec. I need, I need to farm good items off of uh, what's your place. Good job, everyone. Actually, I should have... Nah, I'm, I'm not going to keep that. I need, I need to make Econ ASAP. I'm going Warden Frontline. Take Sword, make Shoujin. For Lissandra. Let's see what champion we two-star first. Four Porcelain, three Arcanist. Um, who doesn't fit in this? Who here doesn't fit? Who's not fitting on this build? Orn is a really good unit. A full AP items. I have Sniper here. Okay, I need I need to hit Ash too. I'm going to lose the game. I need to hit Ash. Oh, I should have taken Morgana. Damn it. Can we hit Ash too, man? Okay, let's... uh. Galio Exalted, that's about it. Can make another Rage Blade with that. I need Ash too. I'm very worried I'm not gonna hit Ash too. I'll farm a lot of items in this Zandra. If I can get List too, I'm in a good spot. Take two Ophelias here. I could take Annie. No, it doesn't fit. Yali is exalted. Yeah. I think I guess Galio's out, right? Is Galio actually out? I guess we don't go exalted. This increases my DPS by a lot. Nice. Way is actually very interesting. Um three warden. Let's do this. Uh let's let's print her. Let's print one Lissandra for free. Oh, uh, we, we need, um... Bar 2, right? Yeah, we're fine. Bar 2 can't break through this easily. Evan Shroud? Yeah, we need Evan Shroud, correct. Screw Soraka for now. We'll, we'll, we'll get back to that eventually. We want to go for Warden, so we're looking at adding Lissandra to the board and adding a Nautilus to the board. How do I itemize my boy? I don't know yet. Alawi 3 is significant. I probably don't buy the Ashes. Oh man, what a weird game. So I'm, I'm guaranteed Lissandra too. 
I probably want to pop these items off of him and remake him if I'm going to three-star him. So I can consider that as well. Because the Mumu is my best tank. I need one more item for Ash. A uh, multiplicative item, maybe Giant Slayer or... Kane could hurt me a lot. Yeah. Orn is tanking hard. And Orn is giving us free items, so... Orange is being Giga Chad. Lissandra is slowly printing as well. Morgana. Can I fit Morgana here? Morgana's really hard to fit. There's a lot of stuff I can cut. Just IE here. No, I'll Rage Blade number two, I think. Behemoth Orn would be nice. True. Rage Blade number two, or I'll go for uh, probably, I don't know, probably a frontline item. Unless I want Shred. Shred's not that bad. Yeah, Shiv's okay. Because I don't want to slam uh, this. And Shiv can fit in a lot of units. You can like give it to a random Lux, or... Who has the better attack speed? Shen's not... I'm, I can't fit Shen, even though he can give me Ghostly with this. I think we're just now chilling and leveling once we can get the level up. Everything's already uh, starred up as it needs to be. Jesus. I'm actually going to itemize him here. I don't care anymore. Uh, I'll give you this and she'll... I'll, I'll get whatever component I'm going to get. And give her another item. That's the plan for now. She will form me a component eventually. And she's getting two stars, so... We'll, we'll eventually find something. Uh, does that work on Morgana? Uh, on Lissandra? Is that a decent Lissandra item? Gumblade would be better. Sure. Okay. Uh, we just relax here. We just take our time. There's no rush. This is going to hit five. Everyone else is super low. So. Why don't you have Teemo Guardian yet? It's a strong board. Why don't I have Teemo Guardian yet? Uh, never bought it. Give the bell to him. I already have one of those. I'd rather save it. Like, worst case scenario, do this. Wait, does she hit everybody when she makes a teapot? Or does she hit one unit? How does that work? Okay, this is a loss. One unit. Okay. What we got here? What did we farm? What did I farm? That's not mine. But... Uh, Alawi, nice. Set here, nice. We're going level 9, by the way. Thieves' roll was hilarious. Yeah, it was, it was kind of bad. We need one more item for Ash. Our Ash is not pushing enough damage. I just gotta make sure nobody 3 stars something crazy. This guy's not rolling for anything, and this guy is looking for... Morgana's... Is he playing Morgana, though? Is he actually playing Morgana? Or is he just rolling for it? No, he has no Morgana 3. We're fine. We're safe. That's a lot of money. Oh my god, I just realized something. Oh, crap. Uh, I got no items for Ash. Jesus. Oh, I'm just gonna give her this for now. Uh, go level 10. Two more wardens on the board, probably. Stick to the plan. Not always. All right, it's not. We're way stronger now. I'm gonna give her this. Alpha behemoth, whatever. Uh. No, it's not always. Not always for full warden. Because we're also running into a frontline issue now. We need to be stronger frontline. Win. Nice. He's dead. All right, one more opponent. One more opponent to beat, and we are looking decent. We got Lissandra two. You take over that. Four wardens. We're quite tanky. Uh, 
Okay, that makes sense. His board is really strong. I want to pick off these units. Galio can, can play with the tanks if he wants. I want these to die first, so... Hopefully Lissandra doesn't die too early. We're, I think we're taking second here. This guy's board is really strong. Yeah, he's really, really strong. Make Shall I prove stronger. them right? I need to find a better board. Faded. I think a Mumu 3 is a big deal. Faded on... I guess I can go Faded Singular. Set Faded? How good is Set Faded? What does Set Faded do? Omnivamp? It's okay. Set 2 is a pretty big deal as well. I guess. Wait, drop you out. I'm just trying to print a Mimu 3. I'm going to cut Morganas out. We might have two more lives. Being how things are. You remove Quay and you get four. Can just three faded. Uh, that's Arcanist Emblem. But it's not worth it. I think we go for... I think we steal this from him. Because Sage is like the best emblem in the game. And he's going to pick it up. Even though I don't really have Sage at the moment. Stealing it from him is just better. One life. I think we might have two. Alright, let me see here. Who doesn't fit here? Hui doesn't Shall really I fit. Right? I think I have two lives. I'm going to play it as if I have two lives, chat. I the spirits, I he's pretty so good. Udyr. Sets a two-star already. Some call me evil. Okay, his... Shall I prove them right? We just gotta hope this is this is gonna survive. I'm gonna have to cut a. Uh, I'm gonna have to cut. If I survive this, I have to sell Orn. I think. Aurelia, Storyweaver, Arcanist, Syndra. We need items for set as well. If Galio dies, I might have enough. Alright, um, so we, we're not hitting a Mumu 3, it seems. A Mumu sucks. Uh, um, who doesn't fit here? I don't know, we're out of time. I, I can't beat that board. It's just too much for board. It's just too much value in his board. His board is stronger than mine. Love the streams, thank you, friend. I mean, for the first game, that's not too bad. Second place, first game, I, I, I can live with it. His board is just way stronger. Ash 2 won't do it, I agree. Maybe I should have rolled for Ash 3. Maybe that was the play. We got a... So he won mostly because he got a massive amount of gold to roll down with. I probably shouldn't have gone level 10. 